You're listening to the sound of California losing ground. Our coastline is eroding at a pace that some experts fear could accelerate as sea levels rise in the face of climate change. Professor Peter Ruggiero studies a pattern at Oregon State. Somewhere in, in the ballpark of you know, 40, 40 to 50 feet um, for the low ends, upwards of well over uh, 100, 150 feet for the higher ends. For decades, construction crews have fought to shore up beaches and cliff sides, saving homes and in some cases, entire neighborhoods, with technologies ranging from cement to rocky seawalls. But now, a research team from Northwestern University believes it may have another solution, essentially gluing the sand into place by zapping it with electricity. In a nutshell, cement sand by using electrical energy. To understand the process, Professor Alessandro Rota Loria says we should look to clams and mussels, creatures that use their metabolism to transform elements like the calcium found in seawater into hardened shells. He says those same chemical building blocks exist in abundance along the coast, waiting to be transformed. So we can basically transform them into solids. We can transform them into cementing agents. So basically we are really using the natural ingredients of seawater to cement uh, soils. In controlled experiments, researchers used mild electrical currents to solidify sandy material into a rock-like substance. Rotoloria believes the hardened sand could be cheaper and more efficient in holding off coastal erosion than current engineering methods. And he says the team has concepts for a mesh-like delivery system that could electrify and harden even larger coastal areas. They are highly scalable because as a matter of fact, you can engineer them with a given size and then you can just copy and paste and, and, and deploy it over very wide surfaces. And potentially use the technique in combination with other engineering solutions. Bolster some sand dunes or some sea cliffs backing some coastline, but for maybe a, a lower cost. Many researchers believe a combination of techniques will be needed just to buy time, including perhaps shoring up the coast by literally hardening sand. In San Francisco, Drew Tuma, ABC 7 News.